This is John Leak with a quick note from the shop. Today I'm doing a little unplugged rustic style. I'm fitting this uh, stick and profiling it to match this post and this post. So I'm doing that by just rubbing a little chalk on there. And then just rubbing that in and then wherever chalk appears here I know it's still a little bit high so I'm just using my gouge to uh, trim those spots down a little So if I trim all that chalk and just a little bit of wood underneath each spot of chalk, then it'll fit a little bit better than the last time. I've probably done this about 15 or 20 times to get a good fit. This will be the last time. Should be close enough now. Yep, pretty close. I think that's good. Next step is to peg that on there. All right, I have just one last peg to put in right here. I'm gonna use my old wooden brace that uh, my dad gave to me when I left his shop back in the early 70s. I'm just eyeballing the location and angle on that hole. It's rustic work, so exact doesn't count for much. I think it just got through the top stick of wood and now it's going into the bottom one. That would be deep enough. I'll just clean it out. No glue, I've got those going in at opposing angles. So that with the pressed tight fit of these square edges on the peg going into the round hole ought to hold pretty well. So this brace is interesting. All wood construction with brass fittings. And I used a spoon bit and that bit is part of a set made by the Snell company that was given to me by Eric Sloan when I visited his 
studio there in Western Connecticut back in the summer of 1970, and he took me over to the tool museum that he was setting up with the Stanley Tool Works back then. And these were extra. He didn't need them for uh, his museum exhibit, so he handed them over to me. I thought that was pretty nice. And here's a ribbon that these particular tools won at the Chicago 1993 World's Columbian Exposition. It says, I don't know if you'll be able to read it, it says, Official Ribbon Medal, World's Columbian Exposition, signed by the Director General. Can't really read it. Looks like George R. Davis. Department H Manufacturers. Augers and Auger Bits, exhibited by Snell Manufacturing Company, Fiskdale, Massachusetts. I've never done any research on that, but they sure made some nice bits. They still work after all these years.